In today's video, we're opening a first edition Metal Raiders box, my favorite set. Final two of our 11 days of Yu-Gi-Oh! It's been amazing so far. I'm hoping today we can pull something awesome out of Metal Raiders, my favorite set. There's no reason to keep talking because we have some amazing openings. Still this one and tomorrow is Legend of Blue Eyes, so don't forget about that first edition. That's a big time box. Let's get right to Metal Raiders. We have Metal Raiders. Who's ready? MRD, let's do this. So let's open this thing up. Shady Peach, you're getting the first pack. Open this box up, very beautiful. Classic cards. No LOB yet, but we are getting close to the LOB opening, guys. If you guys are excited for that. Shady Peach, will you get one pack magic right off the bat? Let's see. One, two, three, four. Can we get Pecanio Moth? A lot of gradable commons in here, so keep that in mind when you pull. Because I know some people actually message me. They're like, yeah, thanks for telling me to grade these. They graded tens. And they end up getting like 200 300 dollar cards. We have Rabbit Horseman, Steel Scorpion, Lady De Fe, Metal Raiders first edition, my favorite set, Tongyo. Lava Battle Guard, and we have a Grande Moth. Starting off, I mean, not a foil, but starting off nice with a Grande Moth. I'm not going to complain about Grande. That's a pretty nice. All right, Tyler, congrats. Metal Raiders, one of the best sets ever made. Let's see what we can get. First edition. I've not pulled Gate Guardian. I've not pulled, you know, anything yet, really, besides Grande. One, two, three, four. Here we go. We have Paralyzing Potion. Hunter Spider. Great price for Tyler. True. We have Occubeam. More Infant. Unhappy Maiden. First Picanio Moth of the day. Very nice. Armin Lazard. And Little Chimera. Starting it off Ofer. Ofer on Metal Raiders. What's new? Starting slow. Maybe we can turn around this third pack. Here we go. Hope you guys are enjoying the video. We are doing a giveaway for a Metal Raiders 25th anniversary booster box. Just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know down below what you think about this Metal Raiders box and what's been our best box so far. One, two, three, four. We have Empress Judge. Soul Release, come on guys. Larva Moth, the Cousin Moth. We've got Grande, Pequeno, and the Cousin Moth all at the same time. Water Harmonix, Cybersaurus, Jellyfish, Cheerful Coffin. We have a Queen's Double. And finally, ooh, our first super, Harpy Lady Sisters. Very nice. That is a super nice card. Harpy Lady Sisters, beautiful. Super rare. That's good stuff right there. And Metal Raiders often more gradable than others. Like the print quality is actually pretty decent. Centering looks pretty decent on there. That's um, good centering on this box. That's a good sign for the relator packs. All right, vintage Yu-Gi-Oh! All right, vintage underscore Yu-Gi-Oh! He knows the deal when he sees one. He said, I'm going for that ultra rare. He wants that barrel dragon. Let's see what we can get. All right, one, two, three, four. We have Punished Eagle. Armored Zombie, look at all that armor. Flame Cerberus. Let's get Lewis something. Battle Steer. Pale Beast, Rux at 34. Jellyfish. Oguchi. Cheerful Coffin. And we have Witch of the Black forest cool stuff so that's a great rare actually so you got pale beast so that's a clutch one we got oguchi armored zombie some of my favorites i mean which is just a generally good one so not the worst pack for lewis unfortunately no foil though <sighs> let's get a gate guardian the only time i've ever pulled a gate guardian was on whatnot i'm just saying so that could happen again castle of dark illusions let's get snake hibikime kaminari attack we got the little chicken niwatori bistro butcher we have Swordsman of Ale, we have the block attack, and we have a Sangha of the Thunder. Look at that. Another nice super, Sangha of the Thunder. Okay. All right, we're getting some good supers so far. Metal Raiders is treating us well, treating us really well so far. Very good cards. Solid condition on these so far. They look pretty decent. We have one, two, three, four. What are we going to get? Will it be our first ultra? Maybe a secret? We are one for two on secrets so far. Gigatech Wolf, we have Saga of the Dark Clown. We have Doma, Empress Judge, Big Eye, Gazelle, King of Mythical Beasts, Musician King, Protector of the Throne, and we have Princess of Sarugi. Okay. Yeah, not great. Not great right there. One, two, three, four. We have Mushroom Man, number two. Last Juggler, Rocco Gregato, Labyrinth Tank, Lady De Fe, Blue Wing Crown, Lava Battle Guard, Koji Kazi. Ooh, and an ultra rare magic jammer. Interesting. Not the best pull, but when I pulled magic jammer, I got B skull. So that'd be pretty cool if that turned out what to be what happened. So magic jammer is like, it's pretty cool. It's not that crazy, you know, for an ultra. But if you get a uh, B skull as well, that's going to be pretty nice. Adam, congrats on the ultra rare first of the box. I do love Magic Jammer because of like uh, back in the day, I used to have a couple of them from Metal Raiders. They're pretty nostalgic for me. Not the best pull though, obviously, but still pretty cool. Grail Whale is back for more. 
Let's see what he can get. <clears throat> Pack number eight. Let's get something crazy. Metal Raiders. One, two, three, four. Leo Gun. Oh, what in the world happened there? That card is jacked up. That is sad. Ancient Elf. Koji. Okay, it looks like they're better here. We have Dragon Piper. More Infant. We have Pumpkin, the King of Ghosts. Crass Clown. Okay, New Moth, second of the box. Not bad. We have a bug in my room. And I say that we have a bug in my room and we have a bug on, on the card. So pretty amazing. And Witch's Apprentice. Okay, the Pecanio Moth summoned its bug friends. Okay, Grail Whale got another one. Okay, good job, Grail Whale. One, two, three, four. All right, Pumpkin, the King of Ghosts. We have Paralyzing Potion. Here we go. Insect Soldier. Hunter Spider. Baby Dragon. That's a good one to grade. We have Launcher Spider. Deep Sea Shark. Sort of Deep Seated. And finally, we have... Blade fly. All right, the blade flies back. Blade fly is not one you usually want to see. It's like, okay, blade fly. Not that excited about that one. Let's see if we can, uh, instead of blade fly, pull like, if it's a rare, what would we want? Sangan, we already pulled Witch. Uh, I fear getting a really good one. What's one of the great rares in Metal Raiders? Magician of Fate. There we go. Got it. Vintage Yu Gi Oh! Good luck on your quest to pull something epic. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Lewis, we have Occubeam. The Castle of Dark Illusions. Roaring Ocean Snake. Hibikime, Giltia, the D-Knight, Nibatori, what's that mean again? Can't remember, Electric Lizard, and we have, no, nope, Thunder Dragon, that's a good one, that's a very good common, and the Robin Goblin, oh, that's that feels bad, feels bad when you get nothing, you feel like you got robbed by the Robin Goblin, the good thing about Metal Raiders, guys, is a lot of these packs, you can make your money back, at 175, you're easily making your money back with these commons a lot of the time, if you get tens, and they're very centered, so there's a lot of potential in these packs, all right, we have Kaminari Attack. Let's go Orion. Kick Attack Soggy. That's a good one. Pale Beast. Also an amazing one, in my opinion. Raikishi Powered. We have Mystic Horseman. Illusionist Faceless Mage. Big Eye. And we have Shield and Sword. Not Sword and Shield. That's the Pokemon. Pokemon. Okay, Pokemon. Different thing. Different, different one. Those had good commons as well, though. A lot of anime cards in there. That's the best part about Metal Raiders. That's why I say it's the best set ever, guys. That's what I'm saying. Halfway point right here. Good job, guys. Everyone has paid for their packs, probably because these are steals of deals right now. <laughs> these are incredible deals on Metal Raiders packs, so just be happy if you're grabbing these. No secret yet. Still have a second Ultra, maybe even a third if we get lucky. Let's see. And the Supers are incredible in this set. German Faction. Let's go, Metal Raiders. Lizard Warrior. Seven Colored Fish. Skull Knights. Armor Lizard. Bistro Butcher. Little Swordsman of Ale. Oh, man. <laughs> it got to me that time. Share the pain and... I'm sharing the pain right now. Yo, Singen, we got it. Pack number 13. I think we have ha half the foils, right? Yeah, the, the value in Metal Raiders is some of the best in Yu-Gi-Oh! in terms of old school. All right. One, two, three, four. We have Crawling Dragon. We got Immortal of Thunder. Mega Thunderball. Bottom Dweller. The Dweller in the Bottom. Watch out. More Infant. Stem Pack. How many Bacanial Moss is that? Is that four? Or is that three? That's nice. That's really nice. Armor Lizard and Mass Sorcerer. Okay, got the Pecanio though. We got the Pecanio. That's solid. That's solid. I'll tell. I mean, it's not mine, but I would. I'd be happy with the Pecanio because obviously, I mean, it's my favorite card. I mean, this is the best out there. Uh, is there a whatnot expert in here to tell them how to get their fifteen dollars to activate? We have Ancient Brain, Feel of Pain. We have Tongyo, Swamp Battle Guard. That's a pretty nice. Uh, I think these do pretty well actually in PSA. Uh, Tremendous Fire. Bistro Butcher. <laughs> oh man, I, that was a weird sound. Bistro Butcher. Dome of the Angel of Silence. Little Swords in a Veil. Is this it? Lock Attack? No, it's not. One more card. Mask of Darkness. I feel like Mask of Darkness actually, it's, I feel like it's a $100 card in a 10, which is like so many of the rares are $100 cards. We're already on 15. Metal Raiders is flying by actually. Metal Raiders is making itself known quickly. All right, Grail Whale. He's trying to get a Grail today. Let's see if he can do it right here. Here we go. Let's make it happen, guys. One, two, three, four. We have Bickery Bickery Box. Wing Dragon Guardian the Fortress number one. That's a classic anime card. Crowded, <laughs> Crowded Dagger Bug Rob. That's a classic Ruxin card. That's a card where I just can never say the name right. We have a King of Yami Makai. William, congrats on purchasing a Dark Crisis pack. I see you three left, guys. King of Yami Makai is a nice one. This is such a good pack. Lady Day Fate. That's a classic one. For me, at least. Steel Scorpion. Blue Wing Crown. Lava Battle Guard. Another good one. And we have Dark Elf. Dark Elf's okay. So that actually, no foil, but 
pretty decent right there actually so many of these packs are like no foil but they just have so many good commons inside which is really exciting when you're opening let's go one two three four we have killer needle skull knight guardian of the labyrinth tainted wisdom mystic horseman share the pain illusionist faceless mage man illusionist that's a good one we have a cybersaurus and we have Magician of Faith, not a foil, but a very good rare. I think that, that used to be a $300 rare. I don't know if it still is in PSA 10. Wow, this is still heating up. Eight packs left, three to four foils. If it's a normal box, this is getting insane. All right, Retro, he's been so lucky so far. He's picking his spots. He's like, I feel like I'm gonna get lucky here. Retro Baloney has been so lucky. One, two, three, four, let's go. Will it be something big? Killer Needle. Guardian of the Labyrinth, we have Tainted Wisdom. Harpy Late, that's a big one. Used to be a $300 rare, don't, or common, don't know if it still is. Uh, block Attack, it's gonna be up there though. Dream Clown, that's solid as well. Musician King, Protector of the Throne, and... Barrel Dragon, there's another Ultra. That's that's in honor of Lewis. Second Ultra, Barrel Dragon, dude. Retro Baloney, he just knows somehow. He knows exactly where the foils are gonna be. He, I mean, we're shuffling and everything. It's not like he can know. He just has this feel. He just has a feel for it. Another huge hit, dude. He is on fire right now. You might wanna buy a lottery ticket while you're at it because you are five for five. No way. Five for five. You madman. You madman. That's freaking crazy. A barrel dragon. Pack number 18. Let's go. Okay, Yadakaru, Destroyer Golem, Ring of Magnetism, Mushroom Man number two. We have the Jurigumo Spider-Man. We have uh, Destroy Gold, Blackland Fire Dragon, Prevent Rat. These are not the best commons. Ooh, I'm sorry, Al Adam. That was, yeah, that was pretty rough, especially for Metal Raiders. There wasn't anything too crazy in terms of uh, commons or rares either. Unfortunately, we'll get, we'll get you something better later. All right, pack 19. All right, Blast Juggler. We've got, okay, Dark Crisis purchase, William. Very nice. We're almost sold out of Dark Crisis, guys. Labyrinth of Nightmare. We have Crawling Dragon, we have Launcher Spider, we have Genzo number seven, Deep Sea Shark, Kojikaze, and we have, oh, the Kate Guardian Secret Rare for B Way 92. There it is. I got, I got my voice back a little bit for that one. Secret Rare, guys, we're two out of three. Gate Guardian has been pulled. That is insane. Let's go. Heck of a pull. Secret rare, best pull of the stream so far. Absolutely awesome, guys. Let's see if this discounted pack can provide an ultimate or an ultra. That has happened before where people are like, oh, there's nothing left in the box. People got it cheaper and then they got a third ultra. It's pretty cool. Uh, Harpy Lady, dude, if this is a 10, you made your money back already. So not bad. <laughs> Yadukaru, oh man, big eye. Ring of Magnetism, Jellyfish. We have a Destroyer Golem, Mystic Lamp. Cheerful Coffin, and speaking of Coffin, that's me. Maybe I'll like the Coffin now. We have the White Magical Hat. I think with White Magical Hat and uh, Harpy Lady, you actually did okay on that pack. One, two, three, four. Oh no, we got a bent card up there. That's unfortunate. All right, Trent, the Int, Punished Eagle, Armored Zombie with that defense, Flame Cerberus, where is it? I'm trying to find it. Oh, it's the Cocoon. Our first Cocoon is bent, that's so sad. Musician King. We have Protector of the Throne. The LB's Rex and 34 and Starboy. Wow, wow, where are the supers in here? This could be a six foil box where we only get three supers. That's possible. Next pack, we're on to number 22, three left. So in theory, there should be two out of three here, but it's possible to be one out of three. All right, we have Immortal Thunder. We have Mega Thunderball, Bottom Dweller, Ancient Brain Feel the Pain, Swords of Deep Seated, Guilty of the D-Knight, Electric Lazard, we have Dome of the Angel of Silence, and we have a Cannon Soldier. Wow. Okay, are we going to get a six? It's probably going to be a six foil box. That's my guess, unless we go two for two here. Let's see what you can get. Got to be something, right? Got to be something. Yeah, if we get that DMG, it's going to be big. One, two, three, four. Here we go, guys. Share the pain. Send me some luck. Last couple packs. Swap Battle Guard. That's a good one. Tremendous Fire. The Int Trent. We have Rainbow Flower. Reukation Powered. Mystic Horseman. Illusionist Faceless Mage. There's Heavy Storm, Lewis. Good call. Lewis called it. There's a Heavy Storm. So that's our sixth foil. So it's still alive for a uh, seventh foil here. Heavy Storm, we got the Gate Guardian. Doesn't guarantee that you get seven, but a lot of times you do. Last pack magic here. Will we get another super? This has been a weird opening where we got like the high end first, but we didn't get the supers. One, two, 
Three, four. Let's hope we can get something crazy. Let's get some good commons as well. Battle steer. He is Sube. Last pack magic for Metal Raiders. It's been a pretty good box. Getting Gate Guardian. And what was our second ultra? Barrel Dragon. Yeah, that was good as well. This Magician. We have uh, Rabbit Horseman. Pretty good. Juraguma is a good one. Black and Fire Dragon. Prevent Rats. We got Tongyo. And will we get a seventh foil or will it be a sixth foil box? Oh, yes. We did get another foil. Last two. Well done, Grail Whale. Suijin. A very solid one, too. That's one of the coolest supers in the entire set. I mean, that's awesome. All right, guys, Metal Raiders is complete. Shout out to Tonefo Show, Daxter, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Deutster, Leo Gwine, 62, Brad KK Beats, Ananda Taisho, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F., Thomas McLean, Changalang, and Joey Castle. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.